What's up, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Sacred Fire, Old Tackle, Dragon Rage, in Insanely Randomized Nuzlocke, episode number 17, hey, that's my lucky number, episode number 17, the last episode, which was of course yesterday, we made our way from the rest house through Fall Arbor Town and down here to this bridge. Taking on a lot of people, battling a lot of people, ke hopefully catching a lot of people. Um, and in the last episode, nobody died! Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Okay, success. If you want to check out that last episode and get all caught up before today's episode, go and click the i card at the top of the screen. Now, in today's episode, we are going to make it to Meteor Falls. I am determined to make it all the way through Meteor Falls. Uh, so we can continue on with the story. I love this part of the game and I'm super excited to play it. As you can tell, I'm still recording the same session as before. This is four episodes. It's the most I've ever recorded in one sitting, but uh, it's all fresh on my mind. So if you're excited for today's Pokemon Emerald, go and hit the uh, like button down below. Subscribe if you're new and answer our question of the day. The question of the day for today is, we're about to go into um, the uh, Meteor Falls. Where we're gonna meet up with at least team magma i do believe yeah team magma for sure um there might even be team aqua in there so my question is what do you think if team magma and team aqua fought each other as they do here but if they actually 100 percent fought each other who would win and we're going to discuss it as we go through the episode let me know in the comments below let's go ahead and get a quick team recap today's tuesday so we don't need a long Super long team recap, but let's recap the new people especially. First we have Takumi, our Ice Ghost type Magby, who started as a Trico, then went to a Slack Off, and is now a Magby. With Runaway, Quiet Nature, stats are pretty good for a Magby minus that special uh, special defense, with Drill Peck, Poison Fang, Angel Power, Teeter Dance. Then you know him, you love him, we have Oscar the Fire type Sceptile. We have Rustlin, our fighting rock type Torkoal. Then we have Jim, our new ish steel rock type Umbreon. And then we have Greta, our dragon type Omanyte with damp, sassy nature. Stats are pretty bad right now. It evolves to level 40, so probably won't use too much until the grinding montage, which I don't know when that's going to be. Uh, but we have Fire Spin, Air Cutter, and Fire Blast. I think that's it. We're rocking five people right now, but we do get a couple encounters today. I think it's because I ran. I've heard, like, Nappy has said, if you run past the trainer, they're always turned to you. For the Lickitung. A little afraid of what a Lickitung can do. All right, we're out of here. Water spout! It's so frustrating. So frustrating. Admittedly, that's what I asked for. When I clicked randomize on everything, that's what I asked for. I was just talking to neighbor about this yesterday when I recorded this. Or yesterday from when I recorded this, obviously. Um, randomizing all the move sets and the types and stuff like that. How am I supposed to know the Lickitung's gonna use freaking Water Spout? Uh, it's... Well, Takumi! I'm sure you were gonna be a great Pokemon. So we know that Rohan would have evolved here. That's still sad. We don't know what Takumi would have evolved into. If you're ever curious about what something will, would evolve into or is going to evolve into, uh, at the bottom of the description of all of these Emerald videos is a link to the paste bin 
that shows everything that happens in this game. Uh, you can always check that out, but do not post anything in the comments. I don't want to know. I don't care. I might run into another Magby, and if you spoil it for me, I'll, it's going to take away from the moment. So please don't spoil it. Okay, so what is going on here? Let me look at this. Fall Route 114. Route 115 is coming up. I think I already got it. I already got a 115 encounter, right? I think so. I think so. Here we go. Survivor Grass. I always remember this as the Survivor Grass. And it's a Breloom. I'm not upset. Have we had a Breloom? No, obviously not. It would show. Also, I did. I was not prepared. You have double team. Ouch. Stay in the gray ball, please. Graylum, you could be so good for us. Stay in the ball, please. Great. Graylum is with us. Let's go ahead and change settings. All right. So we have Breloom, the mushroom Pokemon. It scatters spores from holes in the cap on its head. It loves warm and humid climates. It feeds on trees and plants in fields and forests. I feel like that's like... That could have been written a bit better. I also feel like this name fits. We have Gavin the Breloom. Check him out. We have a Dragon Dark type Breloom with Overgrow, which is, I mean, that fits. Mild Nature. Why can't I get a Pokemon with good special defense? Everything else is pretty good, though. Metal Sound Double Team Dig Weather Ball. So, he's not going to be too useful. Oh, he's holding an item. Apparently. Hold on. Very, very. Why aren't you holding a Master Ball? You know, this whole recording session has been rough. It's been a rough recording session. This is the last episode in this recording session, though. That's good. After the last episode, I took some time. I have some food cooking right now. So, once this episode's done, we'll jump into that. Why do you have Arena Trap? I feel like I should lead with Greta. No. Oh! No, I feel like I should lead with, um... Whatever my Magby's name was. Alright. I'm not meaning to do this. There was a Metang in here. Pretty cool. It's only cool for the fact that, like, the stats would be pretty good. Lynette! I really... Yeah. It's irrelevant. I don't need a Lotet. The Nav Berry. I'm not gonna try the Berry Crush feature. I did it when I was a kid. Like once, twice maybe. Twice, maximum. Maximum. Person berries. Or person berries is probably how it's pronounced. But yeah, so after this episode, I'm done. I'm taking a break. I won't be recording this again for like a while. Long while. Let's switch gym. Let's let the 28s go at it. So let's talk about Team Aqua versus Team Magma. Yeah! Question of the day! I am. <laughs> so, here's the common argument. Most of the time, people would be like, well, obviously Team Aqua would win because Kyogre would be super effective against Groudon. I guess I'm just thinking about this for the first time. What in the world is Groudon going to do to... What is Groudon going to do to Kyogre? Ever. 
You're just enjoying enjoying that, aren't you? What is what is Kyogre gonna do or what is Groudon gonna do to Kyogre? I catch him on here. Yeah, Gavin. I'm just thinking about that, and like it blows my mind that I maybe I've just never thought of it. Stop. You're gonna stop right now. Signal beam. All of these moves that are just triggering me because everyone dies in this freaking game. I need you gone. Oh, I have a Weedle. The Weedle, no Sacred Fire. How about Bolt Tackle? I bet it does. But like, yeah. So I'm gonna say Team Aqua would definitely win. Uh, uh bag is full. That's annoying. I forgot that could even happen. Let's go back and drop up. So, uh, I saw a, a video um, talking about how deep the ocean was not long ago. And uh, it, it talked about, I think I mentioned this in an episode, or in some video that I did not long ago. But it's like, if you sold... No. Whoa. If you um, submerged all of the land above sea level, below sea level, like Mount Everest and all that stuff, you submerged it all, there would be like two miles of water all the way across the planet. And when you let that sink in, what that means? That's crazy. Snaps out of confusion. I guess I should keep that. That could come in here. Escape rope, magnet, super king's rock, miracle seed, yellow shard. Sure. Twisted spoon, keep bright powder. Old item that casts a glare to reduce accuracy. I don't use stuff like that. Oh, yeah, I'll put it in the, the box though. Retro mail. Yeah, you know why you can't buy it? Because it's garbage. Rope lens, red flute, black belt antidote, shoal salt, suit bell, metal power. Calcium, I guess I can sell. I guess we're just gonna put the rest of this stuff. Oh! Color! <clears throat> so yeah, I don't think I don't think Kyogre's doing anything. I don't think Groudon's doing anything to Kyogre. So I'm gonna deposit it. This. This. Red flute. Keep it. The only reason we keep that sacred fire, if you don't remember from episode one, is because that's what our starter was carrying. That's like our, our remember, our our uh, our way to remember where we came from. I regret. Why is this here? A waste of time. That's why. Let's go. Let's fight. Let's fight. Your electrode versus my gym. I bet you win. <gasps> I thought I was joking. Turns out I was not joking. Steel wing, get out of here! God, I hate this game is so silly. This game is so silly. Is there an item? There's got to be items around here somewhere. 
Man, I wish we had more than three mons that we could use right now. Alright, mud shot. Uh, let's just spread the damage here. I'm not really worried. Okay, so here's what just went through my head. The thought of what if it uses counter just went through my head. And then I saw crunch. Okay, so you're gonna die. Uh... Sure. Wow. I am in disbelief that just happened. So you're dead. You sent out a wingle. I hit myself in confusion. And you used pursuit. Of course. Because all of those things had to happen. Are, are you going to hit yourself in confusion again? Yeah, I didn't think so. Wrestling, you should know better than this, my guy. Come on, wrestling. You've been on the team long enough. Don't don't make other people carry your own weight. You got to you got to you got to carry the ball too. Your lay All right. Volt tackle is the new tackle. Everybody gets a volt tackle. The time pass. Why are you learning actual moves that you learn? I don't think I've ever noticed that the sound from super effective, not very effective, and just neutral effective. I don't think I've ever noticed that it's different. But it's so different. So when we do our grinding montage, which I might make for the next episode since... Oh, this looks great. Oh, wait, I need wrestling up front. Poison barb. Here we go. Meteor Falls encounter is... A pile of swine. Okay. Whipped up a whirlwind. You're not going to have a chance to fire off that whirlwind because you will be in a dub Pokeball. You are not in a dub Pokeball. Okay, we already got our name set. Shockwave, huh? Off for Razor Wind again. Hey, you better. It's the last chance you'll get to use that crappy move. Really? Thank you. A pile of swine, the swine Pokemon. A pile of swine is covered by a thick coat of long hair for enduring freezing cold. It uses its tusks to give up. It uses its tusks to dig up. Oh my gosh! It uses its tusks to dig up food that has been buried under ice. Try that. Try that sentence for yourself. In the comments below, let me know if anyone else had trouble with that sentence. It uses its tusks to dig up food. Oof. I struggle with that. So, our name here is... Trina, the pilot swine. Let's check out Clitrina, our pilot swine. With arena trap, which sucks for a playthrough, but we are grass fighting, which is cool. Only nature. Wait, is that cool? Yeah, if we get hit by a flying move, we'll explode. Special attack is off the chain. Which is good, because grass types are off the chain also. Speed is terrible. Shockwave, water, spout. I am hiccuping all over the place, man. Oh, what item was, was Katrina carrying? Revive! and save because I'm not trying or as Nappy says only you I'm not Nappy <laughs> with this meteorite that thing Mount Chimney will eh I don't know who you are but if you get in the way of Team Magma don't expect any mercy hold it right there Team Magma oh wait a minute 
Hold it right there, Team Magma. You're badly mistaken if you think you could have your way with the world. Hey, hey, even Team Makwa joins us. But it's too much trouble to deal with you all. Hey, it doesn't matter. We've got the meteorite, so off the ch Mount Chimney we go. Be seeing you, Team Aqua Dingbats. Why oh, you just run past me? Arr, didn't I see you before at the Slave Horse Museum? Also, your name is Domino. At the time, I thought you were one of Team Magma Goon. <laughs> You're a one-eyed kid. Team Magma is a dangerous group of total fanatics. Arr, they engage in destruction, claiming to expand the landmass. They are rivals to us, the sea-loving Team Aqua. Plus, we should give chase to Team Aqua. Yes, yes, we must. Or Team Magma. Yes, R, we must. Yes, yes, R. We've got to hurry. There's no telling what Team Magma will do at Mount Chimney. Domino, you should keep an eye out for Team Magma too. Farewell. The voice hurts. Also, I have to max Mashi's voice. Like, I have to do Maxi's voice. There was a hair across. I could have got a hair across. And you gave me a pause like. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm Cosmo. I'm a professor. Team Magma asked me to guide them to Meteor Falls, but they tricked me. They even took my meteor right away. And then another several bunch of Team Aqua showed up. After that, I don't understand any of it. But then Team Aqua, what are they, they going to do with the bunch of Team Aqua? My head hurt. My head legitimately hurts. Like, my head legitimately hurts. Don't have Arena Trap, please. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, well, we're actually about to stop. We're actually about to stop the episode. Uh, start beat. Is that like trying to teach me about the process of that? Because I know that like, coming up soon where we do that. Pretty sure there's trainers out here, but we're also at about that time in the episode. Actually, if there's... I don't know how many trainers there are, but let's go ahead and go through them. Want to learn confusion? We do need special attacks, right? I'm going to do it instead of Ancient Power. I don't think I've ever used Ancient Power. I don't think I've ever used Ancient Power. <gasps> I found a lucky egg! Yes! Yes! I found the lucky egg! That's hype. Bible her. Alright, so we have 30s. Let's go ahead and... I'm glad you. I'm glad he turned because I wasn't paying attention. Oh, you have a mew. Also, you're copying me. Oh crap. It's rock fighting. Why are you faster than me? Well, hi, hello. Welcome to the Sacred Fire randomized Nezlock, hello. I suppose I could have treated him to a Sacred Fire. That person had a Mew and crazy you trainer oh my gosh my food's gonna wind up i don't know burning so i am gonna speed up just the end of this episode i don't think it's too big of a deal okay now i don't want to go this way right if I jump down, yeah, yeah, if I jump down there, then I have to go to, to Verdant Turf. Or the Rust Turf Tunnel. So, we're going to save our episode right here. 
Today was a pretty action-packed episode. Now, what happened today? We started the episode by losing a Pokemon, and then we caught two more Pokemon. Everyone that we care about is level 30. Um, so before the next episode, I think we're going to have a grinding montage. I should have plenty of time to do that over the next however many days until I record again. Um, but when we come back, we'll have everyone up. I think the new three are going to be at level 50 or 25. 25, 26, something like that. I don't want to be over-leveled with them. But I'll, I'll research it and make sure that it's about the right level. But anyway, that is going to do it for today's episode of Pokemon Emerald. If you did enjoy, make sure you hit the like button. Comment what you think about the question of the day. Who would win? Team Magma or Team Aqua? I don't know. Let me know what you think in the, in the comments below. We will see you tomorrow for the next episode of the Pokemon Sacred Fire, Bolt Tackle, Dragon Rage, Randomized Nuzlocke. But until then... Have a blessed day.